The message is, what did he say? People do not understand what Christ says because they do not listen. God created all man beings, but he did not give birth to every woman being. To be created by God means you are one of his creatures. To be born of him means you are his son or daughter. Jesus speaking to the Talmud said, very, very I said today, and said the man be born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. God is spirit, and only in gives birth to spirit. Therefore, anyone that is born of him is reborn spiritually, not physically. Your mother and your father give birth. Both of the physical body that you live in. But the main person inside you is the spirit. You are a spiritual being. And that man is one who must be reborn or be born again of the spirit and the word. Jesus is the son of God because he was conceived by the spirit in the womb of Mary. Jesus was conceived of the Holy Spirit when the angel of God released the word of God into Mary and that prophetic word became the seed of sperm to fertilize the baby Jesus. The Holy Spirit did impossible in the body of the young woman. He fertilized a woman's egg with the word of God. And the baby was conceived. The Bible tells us in 1 Peter chapter 1, verse 23. Be born again, not of corruptible sin, but of incorruptible, by the word of God, which liveth and abideth forever. The word of God here, which is the sin, means born. When you are born again, by the sin, or spawn the word of God. The Holy Spirit of God did a miracle thing in you by creating a brand new man. That's the reason the Bible says. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, it's a new creation. The artists have gone and the new began. When you come to Jesus, you move from your physical life to the spiritual life. That's why Jesus told the Cadavers, that which is born of flesh is flesh. That's a physical life. That which is born of spirit is spirit. That is a spiritual life. Remember, that is the God that give us the right to be called the sons of God and daughters of God, who are not being born of blood or flesh, but being born of God. Why is it important to us? Why must I be born again? Without you being born again, you are not having birth. Every woman being must be born again. It is the only way to make it into the kingdom of God and to be disconnected from the certain kingdom. The scary truth is this. There are only two spirits that control a man. God's Holy Spirit are the certain unclean spirit. Friend, which spirit is controlling over you? If you are not trusted Christ Jesus as your Savior and Lord, you are open to the house of devil. Secondly, it is important because your life is eternal, meaning when you die physically, you much, your spirit man. and your soul live on, either in heaven or in hell. The door to heaven is through Christ Jesus alone. And to be born again means that you believe in him and confess in him as your Lord and your Savior. Then you are born into the family of God. I hope this message is clear. I have preached the best I can. What did he say? He said a man must be born again for him to enter into the kingdom of God. And I'm blessed in the mighty name of Jesus. Jesus is Lord.